just so I can, um, just so I can sort of see more of what the hell I'm doing here. Alright then. Again, there is quite a lot of buildings here that we've never actually even gone into, so... Let's uh, try this one here. This is the, uh, the Jungle Gym. Let's see, there's a variety of boxes. Boxing area, various bits and pieces. Kind of cool. A cute little person. <laughs> this is Stuart. Stuart Little? Biggest agent in all Reno? Somebody's done, done you a disservice of not telling you about me. Yeah, his name's Jules. Go kick his ass. Uh, I'm Shadow. We have a strength skill of really fucking high. Hmm. We're looking in the box. Can you, can you help me out? I'll give you a chance. Well, I ain't promising anything. I'm doing you a favor taking some unknown on my wing. My take is half the winnings. No arguments. Sure. Alright then. You're gonna need a name, you know? Uh, a handle. Something that sounds tough. Like, uh, Shadow the Hurricane. Shadow the Brawler. These names suck. Chosen One, Raging Ball, Glass, <laughs> Glass Joe. <laughs> That's nice to see. It's got a lot of names here, actually. Holy shit. Spinning Jenny. I hate to say it. Spinning Jenny sucks. The Bold Ball there. The Macho Man. I'm going to leave. Ripper Shadow, Sidewinder Shadow, Stonewall Shadow. I'm looking for S. I wanna. I'm trying to get that alliteration going here. The Liar, Lightning Shadow. Yeah. Brad Girl. Scrip. I don't even know how you pronounce that. I don't even know how you pronounce that. There's so many names. Look at this. Holy shit. Balboa, Flying Nun, Calamity Jane, <laughs> Bloody Murder, Executioner, New Reno Jim. I can't believe there's this many names. This is ridiculous. This is amazing. There's so many damn names. And we finally made the end. Holy shit. Right. I think we're going to go with... Uh, yeah, this is true, Stone. This is true. It gives the opportunity to just throw shit tons of options at you. Let's go for... Uh, what do we think here? You know what? It's fitting. We'll go for the chosen one. Chosen one. There's one. Not bad. Not bad. It fits. Do we get to it then? You ready? I am indeed. All right then. Time for a bit of boxing, everyone. All right then. Round one. <laughs> Even the little, uh, great. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages above 18, tonight's match is brought to you by Rot Guts. And you absolutely have to have something to drink and don't care what it is. <laughs> Choose Rock Guts. In this corner, the Challenger, weighing at 180 pounds, fresh from the wasteland in the new, new to New Reno, the Chosen One. Yay! And in this corner, weighing at 181 pounds, you know him, you love him, Jock. Great. So without further ado, I know, right? Get ready to beat some ass. That doesn't isn't the most catchy. Round one it is then. This is actually happening. Oh my god. So we have in our inventory some actual boxing gloves. <laughs> Holy shit. This is a legitimate thing that's happening. This is pretty awesome. All right then. So let's have, this is Jock here. He got beat up a lot as a kid. He's got 90, uh, 90 HP. He's wielding special boxer weapon. Okay then. So this will work the same. Guys, don't fucking shoot him, please. All right, and so we can punch. We can go for aim shots as well. This is actually happening. All right, then. 
Let's just uh, let's just go for some body shots then. Get them! Run away! He critically missed. Wait, what? What happened? Wait, what? about what 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 he knocked himself out oh my god <laughs> i think you just won a boxing match if they miss a turn you automatically win i see that is amazing that is amazing jinx everyone holy shit the further an experience of that, we've actually gained up a level. All right, then. I'm going to have a more delve into this, then. So, uh, what is our, our actual hand-to-hand? -hand? Our unarmed skill is 72%, which isn't terrible. Let's boost it. We'll be Boxer Supreme, everyone. All right. All right, then. Next victim, please. Who's next? Wow. If they miss a if they miss a turn, you automatically win. That's a weird That's a weird mechanic. I I have to just say that. That is really strange. Alright then, so second match then. Gamma Gilby. I was awfully concerned the fact that our allies were trying to get involved in there. That was really scary. I thought they were gonna try and fucking gun him down. That would have been kinda funny. Weighing at 180 pounds, the chosen one. 180 pounds, really? Sure. In his corner, you know him at 177 pounds, Pete McNeely. It'll be fine. We'll just say we were busy, you know, like doing some information stuff here. I imagine this does get pretty tough as it goes on. I imagine it does. All right then, so we are. He needs Neely. His jaw gleams like glass. Let's go get this scumbag. Get him! In the face. Not doing the most damage, it must be stated. Go for the head. All right, actually give him the head, nice. <laughs> These brains are already shot. Fantastic. But he's missed, so that's good. Uh, we won't go for a groin shot. That's kind of illegal. Oh, hey! We got him down. Give him a 10 count, ref. Give him the 10 count. Nice. Woohoo! Da 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 da. <laughs> nice. Legitimate knockout, everyone. Legitimate knockout. We are the greatest. I am very happy. There we go. Some of the experience. We're actually getting a fair amount of experience for doing this. All right then. Let's uh, let's have another couple of these. Sure. Getting some decent experience for this and a bit of money too. We need some money. Well, one thing we do not have anymore is money. Uh, San Francisco has made us incredibly broke. Unfortunately, I don't think I can make these go any quicker, unfortunately, this. So, we do have to kind of just stick through this. It's not too bad. When was the last time I did boxing in a series on this channel? Like, the one that comes to mind always the most is Medieval 2. Have I done boxing of any kind since then? Probably like a GTA game, probably. Probably. 189 pounds. Evan Holyfield. Uh, of course. Oh my god. I'm so dumb. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. How do I. I feel like I've just tried to erase that out of my mind. The, the pain and misery of fucking um, dealing with Mike Tyson. Hmm. 125 health, okay, and this could be a bit more of a uh, stiffer challenge, everyone. This could be, this could be tricky. Oh, man, shit, I'm in range. 
right, we're gonna go for a couple of shots to the head then. Headshot! Yes. Headshot! Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> scrub! Absolute scrub lord! Wow, this is brutal. Like, I... This is easy money. This is absolute easy, easy money, everyone. Like, bring on the next victim. Bring whoever you want. Bring me the toughest guy you've got, because he is going down. We are just absolutely kicking ass here. This is awesome. Charges me. Just, just a nice little, just swinging haymaker to the face. He goes down. Game over. Never. I am horribly offended by that comment, Brandon. I am horribly offended that you would even suspect such things. It's just pure, unadulterated talent. <laughs> All right, who's up next then? Uh, 194 pounds. The masticator. <laughs> he brings it out of me. I'm like, what the fuck? What is this bullshit? All right, then. Masticator. That is a interesting name you have there, sir. All right, let's have a check this guy out. His face looks like a raw slab of meat. All right, then. So we need to be a little careful here. I'm a bit concerned about this guy. It's not Matt Mike Tyson. Yeah, a raw slab of meat. Interesting. Well, I'm just going to wait him, let him come to us. There we go. Beautiful plan. All right. Body shots. Oh. Damn. <laughs> oi, oi. The bell's been rung here, I think. <laughs> I think we lost the fight, everyone. Damn. Critical miss means we lose. Jinx really fucks with this, doesn't it? Really fucks with this. Oh, come on. That was like my first loss. One more chance, man. Come on. I get 75%. No arguments. All right. Give me a little time to rest up then. I have an idea, folks. I have a cunning... Cunning plan. <laughs> so, uh, how there's no drug policy in this uh, in this um, support here in New Reno, right? <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> Ignore the fact I've lost the ability to speak. Ignore that. It doesn't matter. It is like I'm This is this is me in focus, all right? When when I'm focusing so hard on a boxing ring, sometimes that can impact my ability to speak. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? I guess. This is going to look pretty bad if we lose this, right? <laughs> I'm literally taking drugs. <laughs> so we're in a boxing match. Oh, God. As I said, folks, what happens in Ureno stays in Ureno, everyone. So um, please... Please, please don't use this as a uh, an example to your kids or your loved ones. I would not suggest you. Um, I also can now weigh a hundred. I have gained nine pounds since the last one. Xander the sure thing, Holy Land. All right then. This could be a good little match. Let's see if my pre-match routine will assist us in this. Round one. No round has... What? 
What? What happened? That was weird. I saved the game, wasn't it? It's a good thing I saved the game. All right, then. Pre-match routine. There we go. We won't worry about the psycho, I don't think. We'll just run with the buff out. <laughs> you know what, Brandon? I like that. I like the head cannon. I like that head cannon as I hit the mic there. I like it. It's just impaired my... I lost the fight, but I don't remember how I lost the fight. <laughs> I like it, Brandon. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. All right, then. So, we're going to try this again. And this time, the game is hopefully not just going to completely glitch out. That was really weird. I think it's fair to say that Jinx seems to completely fuck with this. Like, that is clearly clean. Anyways, yeah, so we are £189. Apparently the buff out suddenly gives us more weight, would you know it. And this time, here we are. Alright, okay, so our actual, our real fight with Xander Holyland. And hopefully, the, what the fuck happened? That was so weird. Never mind. Let's try this again. I, I really don't like that, that, that catchphrase. Beats him up. It's happened again! What the fuck is going on? It's like the game's glitched. It's like the game is glitched. What the fuck? I don't get it. I literally don't get it. Like, I have nothing. I have nothing. I literally don't know what's going on there. Yeah. Is it possible this is like some weird roundabout like drug policy that actually is? I mean, this is this is possible. Like, if it suddenly works, this is like the game's internal drug policy. <laughs> that would be absurd. Like it'd be cool, but it'd be absurd, right? Let's try this. If this works, then, like, that's just amazing. If this actually works. <sighs> Come on, game. They're probably looking at me and wondering, how did he gain nine pounds so damn fast? Hmm, maybe we should look at him. You know, give him some tests. Probably an idea. If this breaks again, then I guess this is just broken. Alright, then here we go. Come on, game. Let's do it. No, it's 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 apparently it's broken. Apparently it's broken, folks. Like it just happened again. I'm wondering like if it's not automatically making me go into combat for some reason. That's the only suggestion I've got. The game's making me come out of combat or something. Oh, is he? Is he actually, um, he's cut content? Ah, interesting. Maybe it is possible that that just, that part of the uh, cut content just simply doesn't work. It's very possible. All right, then. We'll just load the game, and we'll just ignore we did any of that then. We we won free fight, and we lost to the Masticator. You know, that's, that's not too bad, right? Yeah, never seen that. Never seen that. Oh, well, well that's a shame. Never mind then, folks. Right, okay then. So, with that fun and games out of the way, let's keep searching along. Right. So, we need to keep looking around the bars for um, Salvatore. While we're here, we can have a little sit look at the various bits and pieces. <laughs> That's nice. Ah, oh, right, 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 right. Okay, then. Okay, so that's what's going on then. So it is a bug in the game. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. 
What are you talking about? I'm not on buff out. I haven't taken it yet. Rodinus. So he has it was he Hazus Mordino. The Mordinos are here apparently. Really? Really? That is actually um, a Mike Tyson, but not a Mike Tyson who'll bite your ear off and you permanently lose one charisma. Wow. That's interesting. That's amazing. Hazen Mordino. See, as my dad, he's the big uh, Jesus. Probably Jesus. I like Jesus. Uh, head of the whole Mordino family here in Reno. Call him Little Jesus. Prevents confusion, you know? Yeah, I I can only apologize, folks, but I can't do anything about game bugs. It's a shame. Um, I'm looking for a job. Is um, <clears throat> is that uh, family Mordino hiring? Always looking for new blood, especially new blood that's willing to spill blood. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and talk to his part. Tell him I sent you. Maybe we can do some business. I will go do that then. Thank you. Well, these guys look kind of weird. Kind of weird. Right, who are we looking for here? There he is. Big, big Jesus Mordino. Sudik's just like, I will show you the way to him. And I'm like, thanks, I guess? <laughs> Let me just, just fucking barge his way through all the Mordinos here. Quite appreciate that. Never chatting. Turns face you. He looks sick with fever. Sweat trickles down his face and stains his clothes. Ooh. You Jesus Mordino? I am Jesus Mordino. You will address me as Senor Mordino. Who is your business with me? Uh, I spoke to your son. I'm looking for some work. I have work for you. Take uh, this package to the stables north of Reno. Give it to a man. Ramirez, then return. He does look like Vic, doesn't he? I bet he's not going to tell us. I do not pay you to ask questions. Is it just want to know, is it dangerous? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold on, hold on a second. Hold on. So I think we managed to avoid combat with the Mordinos there, so that's good. All right, then. I will go I will go there now. At North Park Virgin Street, past the casinos, follow the truck leads outside of town. You come to the stables. Thank you. Take us to here. Okay, then. Now, if memory serves me correctly, the Mordinos, I think, these are the guys that have something to do with all the jet creation, uh, which is where the stables are, if I remember while talking to Jules previously. And I believe there's something to do with that here at the stables where it was being created. So, um, we may well come back here, folks. We may well come back here. Yes, this is the Jet Lab. So, uh, while we're here, let's do a little bit of, um, a bit of recon, shall we? I have a feeling we're going to do What the fuck is going on Bad place, everyone. <clears throat> yeah. We just giving this package to give to you. About time. We're almost run almost almost out of jet. You take care now. Big J C he takes care of us. Just last week I caught three slaves and were dumb enough to run, so I get a reward, see? And you ain't you ain't get shit. You just bend and fetch. Me, I'm a guard. Fantastic. Also, I'm going to need to close the window. Hold on a second. So, yeah. This is, um... This is not a good place, is it? 
This is not a good place at all. Let's see if we can have a chat with uh, the lead researcher here. May or may not be interested in speaking to us. Oh, it's a woman? Uh, who are you? I'm very busy, if you don't mind. But who are you? How did you get in here? Yeah, yeah, I know, Stone. I know. Oh, hello, Jen. How are you doing, my dear? Um, just so you know, um, I know I've mentioned about uh, Vermintide. I'm going to be doing that after the stream's conclusion, just so you know, my dear. Um, what are the new personnel assigned here? Yes. More guards. <laughs> As if they do any good. Look, you should have received instruction from whoever sent you here. Talk to the other guards, find out about your assignments. Now go. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Out of curiosity. That's that's the idea. That's the plan. Is once I'm done with this, um, I'll be swinging on to that. Uh, I'm looking for Myron. Is he around? Try downstairs in the lab, the guarded door. If you see him, tell him to come up here when he has the chance. If he's not too busy. Uh, okay then. That was easier than I thought it was going to be. Well, let's keep looking. These are the vats. I highly doubt these are containing much water. Highly doubt. I think that's him. Myron. Myron, baby Myron. He does indeed. Uh, I'm here to see Myron. Oh, you are, are you? Well, goddamn, why didn't you say something earlier? You could have avoided this talk altogether, and I could have already told you to piss right off from the start. <laughs> hey, he's expecting me. Nah, you ain't gonna see him. Can you at least give him a message for me? No, I'm gonna get in this fucking place. Well, that sucks. So that is Myron, who I believe is the one of only responsible for the creation of Jet. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I am indeed aware of this. Mordino men. Okay, then. So just scoping the place out here, because I say we will likely be back here. We could probably control it from perhaps in here, but again, the guard is not interested in letting us in. I don't want to start fighting right now. I would like to have a conversation with Myron, but uh, I don't know how I'm going to be able to, able to work this out. So on this side, this must be the packaging side. Right, yeah, this looks like this is, um, this is where they package and ship off all the stuff, I guess. There's a load of Brahmin, and then this is, this is the bad side, everyone. The bad side. Okay. That's good. That's good. The main thing, folks, is we got to scope out the place a bit, which is fine. We sort of don't know things are for our inevitable return. So, by the way, I need Really? 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 